hey guys welcome back to my channel um if you're new here definitely welcome and subscribe guys subscribe if you're not subscribed anyways you guys forgive how i look i tried to film this intro with a full face of makeup on but i've not done makeup in days and i want to put this video up today so we have to film this intro like this i just dropped kobe in school and yeah i've not even had my bath yeah tmi anyways guys this video is going to be my filming setup video i show you guys my setup what is like my lighting camera background and all that good stuff so if you want to see what i film with and how i film just make sure to keep on watching because a lot of you have actually asked me you know what i film with my lighting and all that stuff so i share all those information with you guys today make sure to subscribe like comments and i'll see you guys my next video so guys this is what my setup looks like and this is in my room so that is the advantage of using a backdrop actually because you can film anywhere you want before i used to film in my parlor but right now i just film in my room and okay so this is what the setup looks like here is my tv and this is a window and so i always open up this window when i want to film and also the other window right there just because I still need natural lights, not necessarily, but I like the look of natural lights with the ring lights. So natural light gives you a certain kind of look. If I use the ring light alone, it kind of looks more yellowy. But when I open up the windows plus the ring lights, it just looks way more brighter. So um, this is the backdrop I'm currently using. This backdrop is actually folded into two. I'm going to put a picture by the side right now of what the full backdrop looks like. And this backdrop is five by seven feet, I believe. So I fold it into two. Like today, I feel like using the blue side. And another day that I feel like using the gold side, I just turn the other side. And as you guys can see, I just pasted it on the wall with cello tapes. These backdrops are so easy to use, guys. Um, and I don't know if you guys know, but I've been selling these backdrops. And they are just amazing. The first batch I got already sold out a long time ago. And by the time this video goes up, I believe my... Next batch should be here in Nigeria already, so make sure to place your orders, guys. I'm going to put the Instagram account right here on the screen. Um, you guys just send a DM, call the number, or WhatsApp, whatever you want to do, and place your orders, okay? Help my market, okay, guys? <laughs> Anyways, so this is the stool I sit down on whenever I film, and I always pull um, this table from the side of the bed and just place everything i might be needing for that day only like today i'm about to do a makeup video today i'm filming like um, what's it called um like everyday makeup for moms on the go kind of video so that is why i have a bunch of makeup laid out here right now and that's a stool i'm going to sit on and my backdrop and turning like this this is my tripod where i will set this camera that i'm using right now and i'm using my small camera to film i actually prefer using my small camera to film these days so i am going to um put this camera on this place and then this is my ring light as you guys can see this is the ring light it's blinding if i stand in front of the ring light you'll be able to see it well so basically this is my filming setup It's nothing too much it's nothing extra some days that I feel like filming in my son's room, maybe baby is there sleeping or something, I just take my backdrop and place it in a strategic place in the room where there'll be like enough lighting coupled with the ring light as well. And so yeah, that's it. the sad thing though is that anytime I'm filming, because the windows have to be open, the AC doesn't cool. It's very, very annoying. Like right now, the AC is on, but the room is no more that cool because the windows have to be open. So guys, right now, I just came to sit down just to show you what it looks like. I'm about to film. Uh, my face is still bare, but this is kind of what the video is going to look like. You can see my backdrop, and then you can see me basically. And I set the camera in a way that it, it crops out all these um, cello tapes that I put by the side that I used to hold the backdrop. So it, obviously, I have to crop it out. And I have to crop myself in a way that like this line right here doesn't show. I'm, not, I'm trying not to show my below because... Your girl is not wearing anything down there. <laughs> this is how we film. Like, we basically just put on something, you know, cover the parts that you guys can see and the parts you cannot see. <laughs> Anyways, um, so yeah, that's it. This is how I film. And this backdrop, I just, it kind of complements my skin though. It makes me pop because 
I'm a little bit fair, so it just makes my complexion pop. And I'm, this is my first time using it, and I actually like it. I almost sold some, but like, now I actually sold my other backdrop, guys. The the gold one that you probably used to see, I sold it. Ah, Jesus! Somebody like my backdrop is almost finished, and somebody wanted it, and I sold it. It's just that simple. But I ordered it again. I ordered it again because I actually like it. So it's part of my orders that are coming in very soon. So stay tuned. If it's not already in Nigeria by now, it will be. Very soon, so go follow the nail shop. I'm going to put it, put it down here, so you just know. And also, I'm going to having I'm going to be having a lot of other photography props, things that can help beautify your pictures or your video background, and just stuff like that. So stay tuned, guys. So guys, I just wanted to show you people the camera I film with right now. Everything I film, I film with this camera. This is the Canon G7X, and I absolutely love this camera. It's just, it's supposed to be a vlog camera. I'm charging the battery right now, so. Um, it's supposed to be a vlog camera, but I use it for um, really all my videos, whether I'm vlogging or making like proper YouTube videos. This is a camera I use. It's amazing, I love it. It was a better present for my husband last year, and it's just been my go-to camera right now. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys the camera I use. So yeah. This is my filming setup. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I just wanted to show you guys because some of you guys thought that, you know, I had a whole room decorated just for filming. No, I film on the go wherever. In fact, I can even film my toilet with these backdrops. Anywhere I have good lighting, I am filming that place. Let me put off the ring lights just to show you guys. One second, what? It, the video looks like without the ring lights. So this is me with just natural light. It's really not horrible. Sincerely, there are some videos I want to do. I can film like this. And when I'm editing it, I just add a little bit more light to the video. But most times, I prefer it with the ring light. Yes. And this is with the ring light. So you guys can tell the difference. I hope I was helpful to you guys. I hope this video was useful. I know that, you know, it's just good for you guys to know these things. Because not all of us have... A whole room that we transform just for youtube videos you know some of us are still starting out and trying to make it out here um thank you guys for watching don't forget to give this video a thumbs up share with your friends let them know that it's possible to film you know just film with a very very little budget this backdrop costs ten thousand naira. no this particular one is 12k sorry there are different sizes they are backdrop from like 7k between 7 to 12k i don't think there's anyone more than 12k i try to keep it affordable so it's not too expensive. So definitely check it out, guys. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.